Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, so today's video is going to be a review video of this particular brand that I've been seeing a lot on YouTube, which is called My Glam. And this one particular product that caught my attention, which was the FF cream or something that I think that's what they call it. And it has like a concealer, corrector and foundation all in one small very handy kit so i really really wanted to try that one out and so i bought one for myself and yeah so let's basically let's begin with the review because i have lots and lots to say about it so before we begin with the review i would like to share with you guys that i have just touched 10,000 followers on instagram and i'm so happy <laughs> And you know, so finally, six, seven months of hard work has paid off and it's like a milestone. I've touched a milestone. milestone. Celebrate that. I'm going to be hosting a giveaway soon, which, um, you know, I, I'm, I'm actually planning what that giveaway should be because this is my first giveaway and I do not want it to be like, I want it to be like, wow. So um, I just need like a day or two to plan my giveaway and then I will be announcing my giveaway on Instagram. So if you guys are not following me on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. That's my Instagram handle. For those of you who are here for the first time, I'm Simi. Welcome to my channel. I really, really appreciate it. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel because I post videos every Tuesday and every Friday. So without wasting any more time, let's begin with the review. All right, so as you can see, I haven't put on any makeup on my face there's just moisturizer and I will do that in front of you guys I will be using the my glam ff cream which has everything uh, like concealer corrector and a foundation so I'm going to open it in front of you guys so first things first I ordered this my glam ff cream from their website which is myglam.com and uh, it was for 1400 uh, for that small palette and I received the delivery within uh, two days but there was one particular thing which went like horribly wrong um i don't know if, if it was me or if it was something with the website because i remember choosing my shade fair and so they have only three shades uh, fair medium and dark and i chose the fair one but uh, I somehow received the medium one. As soon as I got the package, I informed them. I sent mails to them, and you know they they said that they'll be they will replace it because I haven't opened the package or whatever, and they wanted me to click pictures of the product before you know so that they could replace it. I did that as well, but there's absolutely no communication from them, and I waited for one entire week. But uh, you know after no communication at all then i decided to do this video and i decided to like you know tell you guys about the after sales service or whatever so just be very careful once you're buying the product just be very sure of you know uh, what shade you're choosing because after once the product is at your home they will not exchange it or they won't even care so let's start unboxing this product so this is the packaging of uh, my glam ff cream it is a pretty big package for a pretty small palette anyway so when you open it there you go you have your palette wrapped in a bubble wrap safe so it says here that it is a total makeover ff cream which is five in one primer concealer foundation compact and skin tone corrector and it costs 1400 no, it costs 1450 So this is how the Total Makeover FF Cream Palette looks like. I really, really love the packaging. I really love the gold on the top. And this is how it looks from the inside. And you have a mirror on the top, which is pretty handy. Then you have your foundation, you have your concealer, you have your uh, corrector. So can I just say, I really, really, really love the packaging. It's this beautiful gold here and this beautiful white. And gold and white combination is such a beautiful combination. I really like it. So it's a very, very handy sort of a palette uh, if you're traveling or, you know, for a daily basis as well, if you want to just have something in your bag at all times. So I think this is a very decent uh, palette. Bare faced at the moment because I wanted to try it out for the first time in front of you guys and I wanted to give you guys my honest unbiased review. So let's begin by using the corrector, even though I don't need a corrector, but I'm still going to use it a little bit just to check. So this is the corrector and it feels very creamy. 
So we usually use the red corrector to cancel out any darkness if you have under your eyes like you know deeply pigmented dark circles or any dark spots that you might have. So we use the red corrector to cancel out the darkness and then we use a concealer and a foundation on top of that so you get an even skin tone. And um, I do not have very deeply pigmented dark circles but I'm still going to use the corrector just to see how this works. So I have it on my brush here and I'm going to just apply it under my eyes so then I'll use my damn beauty blender to blend it all in so so far I do not have any problem it has a good consistency it spreads really well it's creamy next up I'm going to use this yellow shade as my concealer and I'm going to use it over the corrector that I've used and let's check the consistency it's very creamy too I think this one is creamier than the corrector So it looks very yellow. Okay, it's yellow. It's yellow, guys. It's yellow. Oh god. So let's just hope it's not a disaster in the end because this looks yellow. And the foundation is also not my shade, so but I think it's really helping in concealing the dark circles. And it's kind of giving my under eye a very bright, sort of a lifted and awake look. So this yellow seems to be working really nice, I think. So honestly, I really like how my under eyes are looking at the moment. They're looking very bright and, you know, like concealed properly. I can see that my dark circles are concealed and my under eyes are looking very nice and bright. So I think I'm going to use the yellow shade to conceal a few other areas on my face where I can see there's some redness. So I'm just going to cancel out the redness using the yellow. So this is how it looks on my face. I've not used it everywhere. I've just used the yellow to cancel out the redness that I have on my face. And honestly, I'm really liking how it looks. Uh, because I haven't used a lot of product and still I can see the difference on my face. I can see how bright my under eyes are looking. So I'm going to use the foundation which is unfortunately not my shade but I think it's not, uh, the difference is not too much so um, I think it will work well so let's hope for the best. Use this foundation and let's see how it looks. Wow this is creamier than the other two. It's really very creamy. You can see it's not a full coverage foundation, um, it's a very sheer foundation, good for everyday use. You guys can see I've finished blending this side of my face and it's a very medium sheer coverage foundation which I think is pretty much buildable if I apply another layer but you do not need if you want uh, this kind of coverage for an everyday use so I think it's really nice it spreads really well and somehow the foundation the shade matches my skin tone perfectly which is like I don't know, hello, what's going on? Because I spent so much time arguing with those people to change my shade and you know, now it suits me perfectly, which is like, what? Right, so I'm done with my base and honestly, I'm shook for two reasons. One, uh, because I never thought this was my shade because I always thought that, you know, I fall in the fair category and somehow the medium uh, skin tone also fits me well. So I'm not sure how you guys should order. But if you're looking for something which is very light on your skin and good for an everyday use and if you want like concealer, corrector, everything in one palette then I think I suggest uh, this is a good value for money sort of thing. I really like it and it also has SPF. Now I'm not sure about the compact thingy because everything in there is like pretty creamy and there's no powder uh, thing going on in here. Now I don't know how if this is how you leave the base or if you use a powder or a compact to set it. But um, but I think it's dry, but I'm not sure. But yeah, it's, I think it looks really nice on my face. It looks very, I mean, I can see that my skin tone is, uh, you know, pretty even at the moment, which is really nice because I usually have redness around in here. And this being a very sheer to me medium coverage has sort of covered the redness on my face. So yeah, I think, I think it's a good buy. It's 
it's a good buy for the kind of product and the quality of product that they're giving you. So I'm just gonna finish off the rest of my face off camera and I'm gonna be back in a second. All right, so I have my makeup on and honestly, I am in love with this product because as you can see, my skin looks so beautiful, so radiant, so fresh. And um, okay, so I had to put on a translucent powder to set the foundation because as I was applying contouring and everything, I could see that actually like taking off product of my face with the brush. So I had to set the base with a translucent powder. So when they say that they have a compact in the product itself, it's a total scam. But uh, the rest of the things are beautiful. They're nice. I can see the result on my face. It's beautiful i love how it's looking on my skin and you know it's i feel it's it's really light on my skin i do not feel that my cake that my face is like you know uh, cakey or anything of that sort it's it's very light and beautiful that's all i can say and uh, yeah you have to powder it before you apply anything else but the result is beautiful i'm really happy with the product i think it's an amazing buy for 1450 rupees buy you guys can definitely definitely give it a try the only problem is that you have to be a little careful with the shade that you're selecting because medium suits me and i always thought i was in the fair category so you know you just have to be a little bit more careful when you're selecting your shade so um apart from that i think it's like honestly a really good product so go ahead and give it a try so yeah that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did do not forget to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave because i will be posting many 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 more such videos every tuesday and every friday so yeah that's it for now i will see you guys in my next video